Lena to be in Frappuccino. She got scallops with, I can't even remember now. Caramel fudge with to Venice Beach. Morning everyone. Oh, I'm looking quite pale. It's so bright. We did 24,000 steps yesterday at Disney. I was just so tired. We managed to get on pretty much every single ride that we wanted to go on, apart from Face Mountain because it was closed, and the Haunted Mansion that was closed as well. Because we had the Fast Pass, it helped us out so much getting on everything. I really recommend it, like only $15. Like, I know Disney's a lot anyway in the first place, but we got on so many rides, like ridiculous amount of rides. I think it's just so worth it. When you're there, you might as well like do all the rides that you can while you're there. One thing I will say though, is there was a two hour queue for this bobsleds ride. It was not good at all. Those people who waited two hours were gonna be devastated because it was not worth that at all. I don't know why it had such a big queue. Also the Star Wars one was good, like it was different, but I think Star Tours is like really good as well and the queue wasn't long for that. And that's been around for a while. And also there's 18 different videos so when we went in we went twice and there were they played two different things so that was fun but yeah today we're literally just chilling by the pool I'll show you my view today it's looking lovely the beach is looking very inviting like that sea is looking really good so we might go in there later I still haven't had any breakfast but I'm still quite full from all the food yet last night I mean yesterday in general because I just ate everything Mickey Mouse shaped and then we had dinner and we had churros after dinner and then sweets in the car I might try and go to the gym or if not I'll just swim today but I'm excited to chill because I feel like everything we've done so far has been like so much so today is a chill day and then tomorrow we go to Universal I'm gonna carry on getting ready and then I'll show you when we are chilling by the book to say quickly how sick I've connected it to my phone so I can watch YouTube and how big is this TV like this is my hand it's crazy this place for breakfast in the hotel it's kind of like a little shop sell wine got like cookies and stuff got all the it's like Starbucks coffee here water and you, it's so cute, you can get like little mini fruit loops, raisin bran, frosted flakes, you've got apple jacks, cinnamon toast crunch. I might maybe try some fruit loops later. Porridge, and then you can get all the like sauces and stuff as well. It's cute. Me and mum have both got these little chia yogurt bowls with fruit. And then I wanted to try this vanilla bean frappuccino, but I realised I don't think it's got coffee in it. I'll give it a bite. <laughs> Well, that's really nice. <laughs> it's good, but I don't think it's gonna give me a coffee kick, so maybe I'll have to get one later. This is the pool area, I was just chilling. Yeah. <laughs> Found this little lounge in the hotel. So nice. Really cool, like artwork, got a piano, so I'm guessing that gets played at night. It's really pretty. So we're just having lunch by the pool. I got this blackened swordfish sandwich with like avocado and chipotle mayo, some crisps, watermelon. Loving life. Very chill. So it's kind of late now. It's like quarter to seven. We're basically just gonna go down for some dinner. I haven't really vlogged that much today, but we haven't really done much. Just kind of stayed at the pool, went to the beach for like 10 minutes just to see it. So yeah, we're about to go down for dinner. We're gonna walk there. It's like past the pier. It's like a 10, 15 minute walk. I'm just wearing my Urban Outfitters dress. My mum got me for my birthday. You can kind of see like my tan lines, which I'm really happy about that I finally got a tan. And um, yeah, I will just see you when we're having some food or when we're on the walk. I'm creasing. This is definitely the American version of Pop World. That's so jokes. 2016. Okay, what was the name? Uh, possibly. Oh, perfect. Okay. Come to a place called Tanner's. I think we're going to sit outside. Yeah, got my orange lemonade and we've got some bread to start. And calamari. <laughs> this is peri peri half chicken for Lily. Hot chicken. I got scallops with, I can't even remember now, bacon and peas. Was this the salmon? Yeah, salmon. Salmon. 
bar Monday. Lovely. <laughs> what did you get, Nicole? Thank Vegetarian. You. We didn't answer. <laughs> what did you get, Mark Salmon again? Barramundi. Oh, Barramundi. Else. No, I think we're and okay. More Barramundi. Yeah. We're making it s'mores with these little kits by the fire. Got what is these? Graham crackers, Hershey's, which is not nice, and marshmallows. The s'mores, that is Hershey's chocolate, so it's not as good as Cadbury's. <laughs> So we've just finished dinner and having our s'mores by the fire pit, which was really, really nice. I really enjoyed that. Although Hershey's chocolate just doesn't quite cut it compared to Cadbury's chocolate, I won't lie. It does taste a bit like feet and baby sick mixed together. It was really nice. Dinner was amazing. Like, it was so different and the scallops were so nice. They tasted so fresh. And it was the first time I ever had raw, like the raw tuna pokey and that was really, really good as well. So it's another early start tomorrow. No more lazying around like we did today at the pool. Off to Universal. So I am really, really excited for that. So I'm going to try and get some sleep and we're going to get up. We've got to get up at like quarter past six. So I will see you in the morning when I've had a nice little sleep and we're off to Universal. <laughs> Universal! I'm so, so excited. We've just parked in our preferred parking. We think we're going to go to Harry Potter first. Because <laughs> then we can try, because we've got the fast passes again. So we only get one free ride on each one. So we're going to try and get somewhere where there won't be a queue quick and get on that without the fast pass and then use all of our fast passes. <laughs> Um, forbidden journey, whatever it was, but we got stopped like halfway through, didn't we? Near the spider, the spider which bit, which horrifying. we weren't happy about. Um, so we got to go on it again because something was like the screen was black for our parents. So we got to go on it again, but I closed my eyes at the spiders twice. So I just don't like spiders. We're going on the hippogriff ride now. Beware, the forest in the grounds is forbidden. <laughs> got some frozen butter beer. Oh, it's so good. Coming to the sweet shop. Right. <laughs> 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 
is a real fire station. Do you guys know that Universal City is a real city? Yeah, we have our own zip code here. Our zip code is 91608. We have our very own fire station, sheriff station. We're excited to have her joining us again. Uh, but you guys are at 23 over here on the left hand side. A lot of uh, a lot of activity going on in here today because this is where they filmed the show Will and Grace. We were a oh, but they filmed Will and Grace. Grace it's got talent we'll right as well. Now, crossing this imaginary line and going to the back lot. And I want you to have your cameras out. If you don't have them out yet, take them out right now because you're going to love this. Everybody look on the right hand side. We're entering an area called the Metropolitan Sex. You're going to see all these buildings, and they're going to look real. They're not. These buildings are all fake. They're made out of plastic and wood, plaster, styrofoam. Look at this. You're in New York, Chicago, Los Angeles, San Francisco. Look at that. Buildings look down this alley. You're going to see all this brick. All that brick is plastic. There's not one real brick out there, guys. That's literally all plastic sheets. If you keep looking on your right-hand side, you're going to see this row of houses with the steps coming down. That's our Brownstone Street. That's Kevin McAllister's uncle's house in Home Alone 2, Lost in New York. Remember he gets up talking oh the bricks out. It's also where this guy lived in Bruce Almighty. Well, they we put mark, the fake uh, plastic the brick, future. we stuck that sign that said trailers and pictures and posters for this movie. New York Street. Uh, it is not just some normal movie. It is the number one movie in the world. Fast and the Furious presents Hobbs and Shaw. If you guys have seen Hobbs and Shaw, there's an amazing scene where Idris Elvis' character is on the motorcycle in London. And he's going to the streets and he's jumping on all the cars. The windows are shattering. This is where they shot it. They shot a lot of scenes with that movie here at Universal on our Metropolitan sets. Um, this is also featured in Brooklyn Nine-Nine. We have some of the cars from Back to the Future Part Two. We have the Flintstone cars. We have the Drift Racers over here. And my favorite picture car coming up is the Gyrosphere from Jurassic World. You're going to see the gyrosphere, but you're not going to see any glass around it like you saw in the movie. The reason why you don't see any glass here, there never was any glass. You would get a reflection of the crew and the camera during filming. So all the glass in those scenes, it was all fake, all CGI. Look at this tank. That's not a real tank. That's a Bradley assault vehicle the military uses, but if you look closely on the outside, all of that is plywood painted to look like metal. Go back to the All right, so go ahead and get a photo. And then Oh man, I am so sorry, you guys. I hit the wrong button. Oops, my bad. Once upon a time in Hollywood was filmed here. Yeah. So in Leo, it's been here. Really awesome. They had people upstairs and downstairs. Two level set. You guys feel that? First car, watch out on the right hand side. The crowd is breaking. To the Happy birthday, Soraya. Oh my gosh, let's go get this. All right, Shark, there's George. George, what are you doing? Get out of the water. Get back in the boat. George, seriously, dude, get back in the boat. Wait, what? I can't hear you. Speak up. You're mumbling your words. I can't hear anything you're saying. You're on fire. That's not good, guys, because we're on the pier. Oh my gosh, where'd the shark go? Look at it, it's a shark. Whoa. <laughs> There's another neighborhood, like I said, nice coming tree. up at the very top. We're building a linear theater We're style called the Heart of Vision Sound Stages at one time and a large portion of our back lot. These houses have been standing for 19 years. They're celebrating their 19th birthday tram here, so we're going to be taking up. Hey, it's Susan's birthday right here in the first. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. Take it easy, Kyle. Take it easy. Okay. Sorry, Susan. Uh, hey, fourth car, you're on your own, fourth car. This is a perfect example of a set that is all designed around the vision of Steve. We forget to sit down and talk. We are the biggest, the busiest, the most historic studio in all of Hollywood. The lower lot to do Jurassic World, Revenge of the Mummy, and Transformers. Greetings. Ah, fan of bumblebees, I see. All right, recruits. Ready or not, it's mission time. Glad I've got company. Now, put on your glasses. You guys are my navigators. Look at these donuts. They're so big. <laughs> Going on the Kung Fu Panda ride.
going to Spit for Me now and then we've done all the rides at least once. Made it to the cheesecake factory. Awesome. Outside, the menu is huge. This is just the skinny menu, if you can see it. And then it goes literally. It goes on forever. And these are all the cheesecakes. Uh, it's not focusing, but okay. The lighting isn't the best, but we have some sort of shrimp and on dewy sausage with tomato sauce and rice. I was on the skinny menu, so I can get a cheesecake afterwards. What is it, Lil? Fish tacos. Fish tacos. Finish. So we have caramel fudge brownie pecan cheesecake and then mum's yours is like what chocolate and cherry very cherry with whipped cream and then lily's got some massive oreo, <laughs> oreo. <laughs> really good but been defeated mum's been defeated lily's been defeated <laughs> morning everyone so i didn't finish off the vlog last night but i thought you don't need to see me come into bed basically we're on our way to venice beach today basically starting the drive to san francisco today so we're just gonna get some breakfast start some coffee in about 20 minutes and then we're gonna start the drive so i'm gonna show you like venice beach and if we go to santa monica because i feel like that's still kind of like la and then after that i'm gonna start the san fran vlog and like include the whole drive there as the San Fran because we're only there for like two days. Pretty much that's it. I will just see you when we're having some breakfast and then start in the drive. Get it to Venice Beach. I don't know, you can see the mountains in the distance. It's just a really big beach. Got the pier. Some beach houses here. Oh, that one's so cool. just like the streets of Venice Beach. It's not amazing, but it's just nice to say you've been there, isn't it? It's just kind of like edgy, I guess. Surferish. But hey everyone, so I just thought I'd end the vlog here because we've just got into Malibu, so we're we're like really starting the drive to San Francisco now and um, we're trying to find an In-N-Out burger so I will show you that in the start of the San Fran vlog if we manage to find one um, but thanks so much for watching if you did enjoy it don't forget to give it a like and subscribe if you're new and hit the notification bell and I'll see you when we're in the San Fran vlog. Bye.